just realised I'm really overkilling it with the CTFXE stuff right now. Hoodie, t-shirt, yeah, I'm a bit of a fan. I mean, we all have our guilty pleasures. This isn't one of mine. I'm very proud to be a CTFX here. But there are a few more things in my life which are probably a little more like, what? Coming from me, at least. Like the first one that comes to my mind, snooker. I bloody love snooker. I didn't even realize that I liked snooker until earlier this year. That's how recent it's been. But you can take it to the damn bank that if it's on BBC Two, I'm watching that. And I don't even know why I like it. It's just endlessly fascinating to me. The precision, the suits, I, I, wanna, I wanna dress like a snooker player. And for someone who's only ever really played pool before and has never played snooker, it's kind of like a more ambitious version of that. Basically what I'm trying to see, is there anyone else out there that actually likes snooker? Because I wanna play a game and I have no idea where to start looking. Now, most of you who know me relatively well will probably know how varied my music tastes are. My iPod is probably one of the most diverse out there. You stick my iPod on shuffle, one minute it could be like screamo metal, the next it could be NSYNC. Yeah, I actually really love my cheesy pop music. But being the pretentious hipster that I am, I don't like this modern pop music. No, I'm talking about proper 90s music. Yeah. Let's begin with NSYNC, tearing out my heart. What a belting song. Bye bye bye, pop. NSYNC, we miss you guys. Or I do. This is a really lame vlog. <laughs> I can't believe these words are coming out of my mouth onto camera. Yeah. But I'm not ashamed, which is why I'm filming this. There's just too many things in this world that people are too ashamed to like. But saying that Gangnam Style is ridiculously popular and I can't understand why. Now, the final one that I'm going to say in this video will probably shock you all most of all. I love Big Brother. Next shocking point to come. I'm actually, probably, definitely, maybe, it's all still up in the air a little bit, going to apply to be on this year's Big Brother. <laughs> what? Oh my god! Now, I know what you're thinking and let me stop you right there because I want to give you an explanation. I mean, before you defriend me and, you know, cut me out of your life, I think I deserve to at least explain myself on this. Number one, and I can't state this prominently enough, I'm not going on there to be famous. But, to this day, you still see former Big Brother people in, you know, the shitty glossy magazines giving, giving interviews about stuff that, essentially, no one really cares about. I don't want to be that person. If I actually got onto Big Brother, which I have no idea if I would, I'm going in there to challenge myself as a person. Some of my super, super close friends will know how often I say I hate people. And not just like my peers or anything. No, I just hate people in general. If I got onto Big Brother, it would force me to interact with these kinds of people that I typically really don't like. Thus proving the challenge for me to see if I can change my beliefs on what I think about people that I don't actually know. And since I've loved Big Brother ever since I watched it from, I think I started watching series two. So I've been watching for a good 10 years now. But when I really think about it, it really does seem like something I would enjoy doing. I'm not even going in there expecting to win. You know, if I was up for the first week, I will probably be off the first week. So yeah, I hope you don't hate me too much, but yeah, it's, I wanna try it. I feel like for the last couple of years I've kind of been stuck in a rut just doing the same things and while I'm still fine with doing that, a change would be nice. So yeah, those are some of my guilty, pleasurey things. What are yours? Please feel free to leave some comments or make a video response about your guilty pleasures and the world will keep on spinning. So just before I go, obviously you all know YouTube changed their layout again. Pretty much right as I uploaded my last video, so if you haven't seen that, it's going to be somewhere on the screen. If you want to click that, then love all round. Yay. Hearts. Hearts! Yay! <laughs> Not even planned. Oh, I'm terrible. So if you did watch, thank you very much for watching. Two hearts for you, like I say, they are broken, but they are meant to be full from me, because I love you all. Hmm. I don't know what just came over me. So until next time, See ya later. Oh my god.